Jennifer Taylor from Sea Level, North Carolina, tells Barbara Garrity Blake a ghost story as her mother Norma and daughter Kayla listen. Does Sea Level have any ghost stories? Yeah. Yeah. Can you tell, do you know them? Well, Granny told me one, but I can't remember what it was. Was that about Wallaby's woman? Yeah. Okay. That's the one that she told me. There was an old man here that, um, his name was Wallaby. There's a house. Everybody claimed that the woman that he had living here was an Indian. He met her somewhere. I don't know if she was just around here from when the Indians were here and he just married her and, and whatever. But anyway, she died. The story goes that she died in the house and that on certain nights she would come back to visit Wallaby. She had long black hair and in a white dress. She always wore white. People in the community would, would often see her late at night. I won't say scared, but they were just nervous. They would see that lady late at night. I myself had an experience and whether it was Wallaby's woman or just something that I imagined, I don't know, but I've often thought that it was Wallaby's woman from what I've been told. I was working at the Driftwood in Cedar Island and had been working a double shift. I left Cedar Island, was on my way home, and about halfway of that bypass, about where we would go and go to Long Bay, this woman was right in front of my car. I was driving along the highway, just me, nobody else. I was listening to the radio, and all of a sudden, I see this woman in white standing in front of me. Now, am I really seeing what I'm seeing, or am I, is my imagination just running crazy? I stopped. I mean, I just locked on brakes, because I was like, well, I don't know if this person is real, or it's fake, or what it is. So, I stopped, and for about three minutes, she stood just right perfectly still, right in front of me, and just made eye contact. Just stood right in front of my vehicle and just looked me right in the eye. And then in a, just a blink of an eye, she was gone, vanished. 